Hey guys, it's Greg from uh, Signature Camper Trailers here. Uh, just sitting in one of our uh, lovely Ford Folds, the Elite X. Uh, just thought I'd run through one of our most popular um, electrical upgrades that we do in our forward folds. Uh, just underneath the uh, seat here in the lounge area. Just got a nice little uh, kit out for, uh, from Enerdrive uh, that we do here at Thornley. Uh, got a DC to DC charger, uh, full 240 volt uh, site connection as well. It will run through and also a lithium battery upgrade as well. So typically our uh, Elite X forward folds uh, come with uh, two 100 amp hour uh, AGM batteries, but we've done a lithium battery upgrade uh, and this guy here as well. So we've done this as a package uh, DC to DC charger and a 240 volt site connection, but we can do them as individual parts as well and also add on uh, uh, inverters as well from Enerdrive. So often uh, people are after a DC to DC charger for great charging for their off-grid activities. Uh, so just in here, we've got our 12 volt 40 amp uh, DC to DC charger fitted nicely underneath the seat. Uh, so this will come to life when we plug in to the Anderson plug on the drawbar when you plug into the back of your car and we'll also go around to the side of the, uh, the camper here in a little while uh, and you'll see we've got a dedicated uh, Anderson plug uh, plugged directly into this for dedicated solar input as well. Uh, and then also our uh, 12 volt 40 amp 240 volt uh, battery charger uh, as well. Uh, so we've got a 15 amp plug on the outside of the vehicle uh, as well that'll run through and charge the batteries. Um, further down we've got two lithium batteries uh, in here as well so we've got two Enerdrive uh, E-Lite 100 amp hour batteries as well uh, which is a really good upgrade for uh, plenty of um, uh, off-grid activity. Uh, when we do fit our 240 volt um, site connection with this battery charger here we also fit two double GPOs inside the camper as well so underneath the seat uh, there is one just down the bottom here, which is out of the way. Uh, our 240 volt battery charger is plugged into that uh, just down the bottom so that when you're plugged into the site connection on the outside, uh, you'll be getting full charge through to your batteries. And then you'll also see just down below me here, um, we've also got another double GPO uh, down here. So when you're on 240 volt, this will be active. Um, sometimes people, customers are also after a, uh, uh, an inverter, which we often fit underneath seat on the other side. Uh, just down in here as well, plenty of space for a 2000 watt inverter uh, and when we're running that we also have uh, this uh, double GPO active to that inverter as well. Uh, so yeah, fantastic little setup in here. Uh, with the lithium battery upgrades down in here, we've also fitted uh, to this camper uh, an Enerdrive E-Pro um, battery monitor uh, and shunt just down in here. So we'll head around in a second, go and have a look at that E-Pro. Pretty much when you're doing a lithium battery upgrade, it's uh, pretty necessary to fit that uh, EPRO battery monitor uh, to give you good accurate uh, readings on these uh, lithiums down in here as well. But yeah, a great little setup. Nice, and neat and tidy as you can see down in here as well, completely out of the way. But it's a, it's a great little setup from uh, Signature Camp Trailers and Endrive. Hey guys, uh, just back over to the driver's side on the, uh, the Signature Elite X down here, just showing you the uh, Anderson plug input and the 240 volt uh, input as well. Uh, so just down here, got our 15 amp inlet. So if you're at a powered site, plugging directly into this guy, uh, this will run through to your 240 volt battery charger inside the camper and charge, in this case, your lithium batteries. Um, but typically, you know, no problem with your standard AGMs as well. Uh, and then just a little bit further down the line, got our uh, 50 amp weatherproof Anderson plug just down in here as well. This is dedicated solar input direct to your DC to DC charger that's back inside the camper as well. Uh, now, as I was saying a little bit earlier, this camper's got lithium battery upgrade in it. So we have fitted a, a, an Enerdrive E-Pro battery monitor and shunt in here as well to give you much better accurate readings for your uh, energy into this camper. So we'll just move down the line a little bit and show you the E-Pro. So just down in here, we've got our, our standard um, sort of battery monitoring system uh, or the area for it, your water tanks and whatnot, your switches, um, your main power switch, the switch uh, the power on, the 12 volt power on in the camper here. Um, in the middle here you'll see the new E-Pro that's fitted um, to give you great reading uh, on the batteries in here for your lithium batteries. Uh, you've got your regular switches all down inside here. 
but you'll see up with your EPRO here, which is going to give you a much better accurate reading for your, uh, for your lithiums. Uh, up here, it'll give you a percentage charge. Uh, just hit down in here. You'll probably notice you get your voltage reading. Uh, you can shift through the menu. Uh, you'll get your current amp draw in there as well. We've got a few lights on and whatnot in the camper. Um, we'll switch some lights off in the camper. You'll see that amp draw drop a little bit and run through. It gives you basically your, your uh, level of battery power or in hours that you've still got left, uh, which will go up and down a little bit depending on how much draw you've got going on from the different appliances and whatnot you've got switched on. Uh, temperature, you don't need to worry about that with your lithiums. Uh, and back through to your voltmeter. So it gives you a really good accurate readout, uh, much better than a standard uh, battery monitor, particularly when you're fitting your lithiums. This is also good for your AGMs though as well, so you can always do this EPRO, uh, even if you've got standard AGMs in here as well. Uh, so yeah, got any inquiries, just get onto us.